The lawyer for a French novelist says he mailed the complaint that alleges Dominique Strauss-Kahn sexually assaulted her eight years ago. Tristan Bonan told a French news magazine that she was tired of hearing lies and rumors told about the incident. Bonan's lawyer says her mother talked her out of filing charges at the time, fearing that going after a high-profile political figure would harm her daughter's career. She now appears to have reached the conclusion that if she doesn't bring charges against Mr. Strauss-Kahn, everybody thinks that she's just a liar. So she's probably being forced into believing that she has to go forward now or she will otherwise be treated as someone who is dishonest. The request for French officials to investigate Bonan's claim comes as the American case against Strauss-Kahn may be faltering. The credibility of the maid who says Strauss-Kahn raped her has been called into serious question. Before he was charged in the U.S. case, Strauss-Kahn was seen as a strong contender to be the next president of France. In the American case, French people believed that many people believed he was the victim of American legal excess. If there are charges that are brought against him and sustained against him here in France, the legal system that everybody knows, it will be much harder for people in this country to say that he is the victim of French legal excess. Strauss-Kahn has labeled Bonan's account imaginary. He threatened to file a criminal complaint of slander against her. Also Tuesday, his New York accuser filed a libel suit against the New York Post after it called her a prostitute. The paper says it stands behind its reporting. Strauss-Kahn was released without bail following the uncertainty about the maid's background. His next scheduled court appearance is July 18th. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.